Hey guys, it's me, Drew, and welcome back to my channel. As you see from the title above, this is going to be a Scentsy haul. Now, I have not opened the box. It is still, it is still, it is still sealed with love, as it says, right? Doesn't it say that? Scent with love. And I haven't opened it yet, so we're going to open this together. But these are some Bring Back My Bars that I wanted to stock up on. And shout out to Amy, Amy Sense and Songs. We've been talking a little bit back and forth over on Instagram. If you do not follow Amy, I love Amy. She is so sweet. Such a bundle of joy and light in this community. And she just is great. I love her videos. I love her content. She is such a sweet human being. And we were talking about the Bring Back My Bars and which ones I'm going to pick up, which ones we're going to add to our club, just a little bit of that back and forth. And um, if you don't know, too, by the way, you do get this little invoice type of situation, like a packing slip in your boxes. So everything is here. Nothing is out of stock. A little bit of Scentsy paper, which we love. And are you ready? My favorite. A box inside of a box. So let's slip that guy off. There we go. And we have a box inside of a box full of bars. So I decided to pick up a few bars still, and I'll explain the justification on why I picked up the bars that I did. Some more Scentsy paper. We love that. Lots of Scentsy paper. Oh, I'm like... These are not warmers. I forgot. I ordered some dishes. One of these is the pink lid or the dish for the summer rain warmer. I don't know what happened to it, but like the paint, the finish is actually coming off of the dish. So I wanted to replace that with a fresh brand new one. And then my in the clouds warmer actually dropped and broke. So I wanted to get a replacement dish of that. So those are replacement dishes. You'll never guess. More Scentsy paper. I love that. And then, is this not the prettiest sight you ever do see? A box full of bars. I love it. All the bright colors, and I see lots of amazing bars here. Now, full disclosure, all of these bars are not for me. Uh, my best friend also picked up a six-pack here of some Bring Back My Bars that are mixed in, and I will explain those. But without further ado, let's get into it. First up, we have two bars of Flower Shop. I love Flower Shop. This scent is so pretty, you guys. It just smells exactly like walking into a flower shop. The green stems, the water, the like ice cold case of flowers. Mm, I love it so much. It is in my club, so I wanted to pick up a few more bars of Flower Shop. I also picked up a cucumber lime. Now, cucumber lime is so strong, so bright, zesty, zesty lime with that fresh, crisp cucumber. It's so pretty. So I picked up one of those. I also picked up, there should be two here, so I'll see. It's right under it, actually. Perfect. Two melon and apple granita. This is beautiful. These are all, obviously these are all good. These are all ones I've smelled that I've reordered. Oh, I love it. To me, the closest like regular bar this compares to is Skinny Dippin' and I like it way more. I love the little bit of like the effervescent zest of the granita and a little bit of that fruity, fruity apple with the cantaloupe. It's beautiful. I love it. It's definitely going in my club. It's so pretty. Oh, speaking of pretty that I love, we have Apple Press. Two Apple Presses. Now, Apple Press is like apples and pears and a little bit of rose. I don't smell the rose. I wish I did because I love the scent of roses. That's why, like, the scent of the month for January, you guys, Pineapple Rose. If you have not picked up Pineapple Rose... It's beautiful. I love it. It's so rosy, and it's like that powdery, bright pink rose that's perfect for Valentine's Day, perfect for spring, and rose is like one of my favorite fragrances, so I'm really excited for that, but I love Apple Press. It's a bright, fruity, fruity apple. Next is Amazon Rain. Now, my friend was actually talking about this one. I, there's some random bars that aren't just Bring Back My Bars, and I was like, Amazon Rain? I... 
I melted it years ago, but I really don't remember it. And she was said she walked into one of her friends' houses, and that's what they were melting, and she could not believe how amazing it smelled. And I'm like, okay, I need to pick up a bar again, so I'm excited to have a bar of it. It's very bright. Um, the rain is a little bit aquatic, but for the most part, it's more of a, like, fruity scent. So we shall see. So Amazon Rain. Ooh, Woodland Suede. There should be two. Yep, yeah, in here. Love. You'll see this in my trash talk in my empties videos. Um, the ones that you might have been like, he hasn't talked about them yet. Woodland Suede is to die for. It's like a creamy vanilla forward men's cologne fragrance. It's how I describe it. I'm obsessed. I love it. It lasts for days and days and days and days. This and Flirtatious have been the longest lasting bars of any of the Bring Back My Bars I've had. And Woodland Suede to die for. I love it. It's going in my club and it's never, ever leaving. I love it. Love it. Blue Sage and Tonka. This is another one that, like, everybody loves and I really like it. But I feel like I haven't experienced it enough. It's so nice. The Sage is green. And to me, this is more of like an evening men's cologne fragrance. A little bit deeper, a little bit of like a cedarwoody, sandalwood background. Oh, it's so nice. So nice, so woody, so fresh, so delicious. Oh, is this my baby? Oh, I wish these were like organized. I should have organized them earlier, but oh, flirtatious. I love it. 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 This is grapefruit and apple. It's nostalgia because I remember melting it years ago, and it's just as good now as it is then. I love the color, bright pink. It's definitely going in my club, and I'm definitely happy to have more of it. Now, these, I ordered one of each of these bars. I typically do two of each, but I did one of each of these bars because I heard Lisa Roberry share in a Mix It With Me video that I think a, a customer told her about this. It is a cashmere and corduroy and scarlet sunflower. So I love both of these fragrances on their own, but I hear a cube to a cube. For one, the colors are so cute. I love them. I think they're going to look great together. Is magic. Oh, cashmere and corduroy is so pretty. This is definitely year-round for me. It just smells like a very warm, comforting bedroom scent. And I know that if it does get discontinued for the fall and winter, like for the spring and summer series, I'm definitely adding that to my club. And same with Scarlet Sunflower. It's so bright. Okay, so if you remember When by Chaz Dean, I mean, it's still around, but he has a line called 613. And it's lemon, rosemary, and vanilla bean. I know none of those are the notes in here, but it literally smells exactly like When 613. So if you've ever used 613 from When, let me know if you think so, too. It totally smells like it to me. So mixing those two together, I'm really excited. Speaking of, like, delicious, yummy bedroom scents, we have Cozy Cardigan. Maybe. Let's try it again. Cozy Cardigan. There we go. Okay. Cozy Cardigan. There we go. Love it. This is... This is just body care, a little bit perfumey. It's beautiful. So nice. I think everybody's tried Cozy Cardigan, and I think the bar background looking like an actual, like, cardigan is so cute. So excited to have more of that. A classic that I'm actually out of, which I cannot believe, Blueberry Cheesecake. People either love or hate Blueberry Cheesecake. Obviously enough people love it because it's still in the catalog, but it's so good. It's creamy, creamy cheesecake with rich, delicious blueberries. And the cheesecake note, it's not sour. At least to my nose. I've smelled some cheesecake scents that smell sour. And this does not to me. It's just like delicious, creamy, yummy cheesecake. Love blueberry cheesecake. Now, this is a bar I've yet to try. I'm super excited to try it, though. Everybody raves about it. It was just the time and sensey that I just wasn't ordering fluffy fleece. So I've never smelled it, but everybody says how great it is, and it's totally a scent that sounds up my alley. Love the color. Okay, let's see. Oh, yeah. This is pretty, guys. This is pretty. 
And even though there's like pictures of sweaters and stuff, I totally can see how this is a winter fragrance. It's like eucalyptus y, like fresh snow, warm blankets. This is definitely cozy, cozy and fresh. Oh, that's nice. Definitely, like I said, like I could see how this is amazing in laundry. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, that's beautiful. This is one that I would mow all year long. I definitely, like, as much as I'm a bakery guy and I love my bakery, my foodie, like my blueberry cheesecakes, my apple pies, I love these more clean, fresh scents lately. I've just been so into them. So Fluffy Fleece, really, really like that one. Oh, my eye. There we go. Next, mm, I don't know why I, before I, like, placed this order and edited it, Where's the other one? Here it is. I don't know why I got these again. I haven't melted my first bar yet. So I'm like, why did I add two of these? I must have thought I really liked it. Green tea smoothie. So I have two of these. I don't hate green tea smoothie, but I just don't love it. It doesn't smell like anything crazy to me. I actually was watching Ramona's video today. One of her Bring Back My Bar Meltings. And she said that this is, like, very similar to, like, sea salt and avocado in the vibe that you get. Like, it's very green, fresh. Like, if you cooked fish or something that you didn't want to, like, to smell at the house, this is what you would melt. And I totally get that. However, I don't know. I haven't melted it. I might blow my socks off when I melt it, but I have two bar three bars of it now. So, we shall see. This one, I also think I ordered two bars of. Yep, I'm actually melting it in my bedroom now. And I'm happy that I have some more bars of it because I don't think I'm going to add it to my club for now. For now, I don't think I'm going to add it to my club. And But having some extra bars is nice. Coconut pumpkin pie. I like it, but it's not blowing my socks off. It's like a very, very creamy, creamy pumpkin pie. To me, the coconut just, wow, this clam is so thin, just makes it smell a little bit more creamy. I don't think it's like coconut. I mean, there is coconut. You can tell it's coconut, but it just adds more of a creamy bakery to it than like tropical, if that makes any sense. Like a toasted coconut or a shredded, like coconut cream pie base, sort of. So it's nice. I don't love it, though. It's not like blowing my socks off. Speaking of doesn't blow my socks off, I know everybody's going to come for me with this one. I'm giving it yet another try. I just don't smell like anything from this anytime I melt it. Winterberry apple tea. I, I don't know. I just don't. It's, yeah, it just smells like, like, very, very light, like, berries. Like, I don't really smell anything from it. Who else is on the train of they don't care for winterberry apple tea? Or am I just crazy? I, I don't know. I don't... I mean, I know some of you are going to say I'm crazy anyway, so whatever. But, yeah, I just don't... I don't know. I Like I said, I'm going to have it sit, and I'm going to just experience it again. But for now, I don't... I do not understand the hype. Now, this is one that people don't understand the hype for that I love it so much. Pima Cotton. I actually have two bars coming in my club. I added two bars to my club. I'm obsessed. I never want to not have this. This Flirtatious and Woodland Suede. Such long performers. This is the best. I say it smells like the Yankee Candle. Years ago, they had a World Treasures line. Um, Egyptian Cotton. It smells exactly like it. It's fresh sheets. The windows are open. Open. It's blowing the sheets. This is the best laundry. Whoops. <gasps> I just dented it. This is the best laundry scent that Sensi does. I love it. I love Pima Cotton. And so happy I discovered it. It's going in my club. And it's never leaving. <gasps> Two bars. A cranberry muffin. Another one that I just adore, adore, adore. So good. This is another nostalgic one. It smells just like a delicious, moist Yellow muffin loaded with fresh cranberries. It's delicious. I never want to be without this one either. This is another nostalgic bar for me. Oh, we're getting into some for my friend because I did not care for these. Um, well, this one I don't know yet. Autumn Stroll. Um, this is nice. 
it's like a very cedarwood heavy autumnal scent. So it's nice. I haven't melted it yet, so I don't know. It is in my club until I melt it. Autumn Blaze Maple is not in my club, and I don't think it's going to go into my club. It just isn't special to me. It just smells like a generic fall scent, like an apple pumpkin spice scent. If I want apple pumpkin spice, I definitely lean more towards cider mill because it's more juicy apple, where this is more cinnamon apple. And this was a big flop. Hazelnut latte, especially in my house. I did it in the office. It does not smell like coffee. It smells... It smells like like a frappuccino, essentially. Like a very, very, like, uh, hazelnut, sure. Like, nutty, warm. I know frappuccinos are frozen, but, like, warm ingredient frappuccino. Yeah, like foamy, milky frappuccino, but no, no real coffee. And it didn't last long either. Now, there's three here because my friend got one, and I got two. Another one is in my club, and it's not leaving. Mediterranean Spa. This is beautiful, you guys. Beautiful bar. I love it. I never want to be without it. Oh, it's so pretty. It's like a hint of lemon. Beautiful, like eucalyptus. It's bright. It's fresh. I almost dropped it. It's so good. So good. So good. So good. Never, been, never ever, ever want to be without it. It's bright. It's fresh. And I actually saw somebody, I can't remember who it is, say it reminds them of Just Breathe just a little bit. Like, the tiniest bit of, like, what's in Just Breathe. And I can see that. I don't like Just Breathe, though, and I love this. So, there's that. Down to my last three bars. Um, these guys, for me, two bars, crumb top. I added this to my club, but I haven't melted it yet. I have to re-smell my bar. Because I think my bar was kind of, like, boring and plain and basic. But this... And maybe it's because, like, these were poured at the same time and this one has just been sitting. This is nice. This is, like, oats, cinnamony, but, like, more bakery cinnamony. This is really nice. Ooh, okay. Today's Friday when I'm filming this. I think tomorrow's Saturday. I have nothing to do all day. And it's going to be cold and rainy. I think this is going in my bedroom. Crumb top. This is nice. And then in Sunday when I fill my empties, you'll be able to see. Yum. Okay. The Lush. Really like that. Wait a minute. And then another Autumn Blaze Maple. My friend I know ordered one. I must have ordered one too. Did I? Autumn Blaze Maple. Yeah, maybe I did. So that way I can experience it more than once, I guess. It's so very interesting. It's like bright yellow on the top and like very dark yellow on the bottom. No, no. It's, it's, yeah. It's very generic fall craft store vibe. Is that what I, that's what I get from this. So I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. That was my bring back my bar slash extra. I'll just call this like a sensi January haul. Wasn't a ton of stuff, but I did want to film it for you guys so you could see. I'll leave my link to my Sensi website down below. There is a Bring Back My Bar celebration party if you want to shop there. Who ordered from the flash sale? I saw a couple of you did, and I certainly did. I got 20 bars and a warmer for, like, $67. It was crazy good deals. It Like, everything was gone in a couple hours. Sensi kills it with the flash sales, so... I'm sure it'll be a while before that ships and gets to me, but I'm really excited for that one. Thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit that notification bell down below. That way you're alerted every time I upload a video here on YouTube. Make it a better world. Be kind. And I love you all so much. You matter. Bye, guys.